Tara Carnes. I'll be a senior at Wilmington College, majoring in accounting, business administration with a concentration in marketing. And I'm really excited to tell you all about my summer internship at GBQ Partners. At GBQ, I got to work in the assurance department, which consisted of us doing employee, employee benefit plan audits, regular audits, and some reviews. GBQ Partners is an accounting firm in Columbus, Ohio, located in the Arena District. It, GBQ is a regional accounting firm, which means we're a step down from the big four. One of our direct competitors is Plant Moran. This summer, I've been engaged in many new opportunities that I didn't even know existed in the county, accounting world. Since I was a little girl, my mom has always been an accountant my whole life, and I thought I knew exactly what accounting was. I am here to tell you that I was so wrong. Accounting is so much more than the small town accounting firm that my mom has in Wilmington. My sister is now a CPA at Deloitte & Touche, which is a big four accounting firm. I thought I understood. I didn't. Nothing compares you for when you are in the field firsthand. I have been on many different clients and got to do a variety of different tasks. I've been with Inglefield Oil Company audit. I have been on Spirit Services audit. I've been on Spirit Services employee benefit plan. I've worked at Southeast on their nonprofit audit, which was a whole new experience, but so rewarding to see the work that they've been doing. I've also been on Buckeye Power Sales employee benefit plan as well as Air Force One employee benefit plan. Each engagement holds a very different weight and you get to learn new things on every engagement because not one company is the same and you have to do a little bit of something different for every company. Coming in, I set two object objectives that I wanted to accomplish by the end of my internship. My first objective was that I wanted to see if public accounting was the right fit for me. I started out as a pre-dental major at Wilmington College and soon realized that was not for me. So I switched to accounting, met some amazing people, have some of the best professors, but I still just wasn't sure that it was for me. I can proudly say that after my internship at GBQ Partners, and the conversations I've had with amazing individuals in the industry and the connections that I've made, I'm proud to report that I can see myself being in public accounting. I don't know at what scale yet. I don't know if I want to be in big four. I don't know if I want to be regional. I don't, want to know, I don't know if I want to be in a small town accounting firm. I don't know if I want to be in corporate. I don't, want, I don't know what I want to do. But I know that I do love public accounting and I do love the people in public accounting. You work every day with talented, driven, and knowledgeable individuals who grow you as an individual. My second learning objective was I wanted to be more confident in my knowledge of accounting. I wanted to be able to make judgment calls and I wanted to be able to make decisions without having to consult someone or having to ask the question. I'm the person that likes to know I'm doing it right before I do it. I like for someone to give me a little bit of encouragement and let me know that I'm doing it correctly. This summer, I've had to completely jump out of my box because they give you a work paper and they say, here, figure this out. And you maybe can ask two questions at the beginning and then two hours down the road, you're still working on that same work paper and you have to ask a little bit more. But I've learned to make some judgment calls and make my own knowledge and be confident in what I know that I've been able to make some very good quality work papers for clients and for senior managers who are reviewing that are saying I'm doing a great job, which is very rewarding. One of the biggest projects I've had to work on and one of the biggest work papers is with Inglefield Oil Company. I had the privilege of doing their search for unreported liabilities. A work paper that was budgeted 
for 25 hours. 25 hours of work. That's three days or more of work. I am proud to say I completed that work paper and got a great review. I am so excited to come back to Wilmington College and teach everyone else what I have learned while at my internship. I can't tell you enough about how amazing this internship has been, but it hasn't all been great. I've had to learn about myself. I've had to adapt to some people that weren't so great. And I've had some really tough days where there hasn't been work for me to do. And I've had to stay positive. I think some really important key things that I have learned is that I know I have grown as a person. I've grown as an individual and I kind of have decided who I want to be and what I want to become when I grow up. One of the most rewarding things that GBQ does is their community involvement. So they do a number of different things, one of which is they have a school in the Columbus area that comes and mentor, not mentors, that comes and observes people, what they're doing. We have our employees are mentoring these students at this school to help them, push them on the right track to go to college and get jobs. And it, that is one of the most rewarding ones. Other things we're involved in is the Ronald McDonald House charities, PBJ Connections, um, Pelotonia, um, and food banks. And so each Friday, so our schedule is a little different at GBQ. We go from 8 to 5.30, Monday through Thursday, and on Friday, we go from 8 to 2. So each Friday at 2, we're given the opportunity to go out into the community and volunteer. And every Friday they have a volunteer event that you can go to. I have loved doing those volunteer events. I have made such a connection with things I've learned in the classroom. A lot of people say, why can't we just start in the industry? Why can't we just learn from doing? I can tell you and every other member of the lower class that things I learned the first day of my Principles of Accounting 1 class, I used during my internship. And it, I think it makes going back to school a little bit easier because I know that the things I'm learning are going to help me in the long run. So I'm going to lead you through virtually a few points, um, just show you up close a few pictures that are on my board. I have my computer sitting out here because there is not a day this whole summer that I have not looked at my computer for eight plus hours. And I think that's crazy, but everything we do is online. If I could give Wilmington any sort of help with their curriculum, which is something I am really considering loving to do, is that I would make sure in the accounting program, in the business program, that Wilmington built an Excel class into their program and into their major because I have felt that is one area that I have felt so behind in my career, in my internship was Excel. I have not known how to do hardly any of it. So Wilmington, please, please get your students an Excel class. Another thing that I urge Wilmington to do with their curriculum is make it mandatory that every accounting major has an internship. No one can get better experience than an internship or getting involved with VITA, of course. 